Families devastated by disasters in the past year are getting some much-needed help this holiday season. As ABC 40, Michael Cross tells us, thanks to the kindness of others, Christmas Day will again be exciting. He'll love that because then he can feel like a baby again. Danielle McBain is thankful she'll be able to give her three kids a bright Christmas this year. I was so surprised to hear them when they called me and said, we're going to have Christmas presents for you because it is a rough year. Last March, McBain lost everything when her Ballinger Town home burnt down. The Red Cross is like, I don't know what we would have done. Without them, I don't know what we would have done. Saturday, McBain was one of 57 families benefiting from the annual Red Cross holiday toy distribution. The program provides toys to over 123 children who've been through a disaster in the last year. We know that during the first year after a fire, families don't have any extra money for, for toys, and the holiday becomes very stressful for them. Each of these boxes is filled with toys thanks to the help of 25 local businesses that donate toys like these that are brought here to the Red Cross. They're sorted and then put in the boxes depending on the family's specific needs. Our volunteers have worked very hard to sort all the toys by age and gender and custom pick toys that will be appropriate for that family. The Red Cross staff and volunteers also enjoy handing out the toys. Our caseworkers that have worked with them on the fire seeds at the worst time of their life now get to see those folks again at a better time, a happier time, and we reconnect with them and make sure that their recovery is going forward. Danielle McBain says the help she's received has shown her the true meaning of Christmas. When you get old and you don't believe in Santa anymore and then something like this happens, you realize that Santa's real. In Springfield, Michael Cross, ABC 40.